Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to update WhatsApp on a Mac. So you might have a WhatsApp that is old. So if you look at your Finder, we're going to go to Applications. And if we look at our WhatsApp, it says here it's the old version. And what we're going to do is an update of this so we can get the new version and we don't have the old icon. So we're going to go to the App Store. And then we're going to go ahead and do a search for WhatsApp for Mac. Just do a search here. And then we need to make sure that we have the correct app here. So we want this one here. WhatsApp Messenger from the WhatsApp Inc company. So here we're just going to press the download button. If you're downloading this for the first time, it's going to say get. That just means it's a free app to download. So just download this. So once that's done, we can press open. And now WhatsApp desktop has opened up on the Mac. So we need to make sure that we quit out of our old WhatsApp. So control click on WhatsApp old and press quit. And now we're going to link the device from our phone. So all we need to do is go to the WhatsApp app on your phone and then go into the settings menu here. So make sure to click on the settings on the bottom right and then click on this QR code icon on the top right hand side of the iPhone screen. And then here we need to press the scan button on the top right hand side. And then we need to scan the code on the screen of the MacBook. Press continue. And then it says here, link a device. I'm gonna press link a device here. And then once again, we're gonna scan that code on the phone, press okay. Now we are logging into the computer. It's also downloading and syncing all of our old messages. So here we're gonna name the device, press save. Now we have the MacBook Pro syncing up to WhatsApp and now we're done. So here we've got notifications. I'm gonna press done here and then we can change our notification settings later. And now basically WhatsApp has been fully installed on the Mac and we can go ahead and get rid of the old WhatsApp if you like. Anyway, I hope you found this video useful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.